Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today I'm going to be decorating the pages in my dashboard planner for the week of October 11th through the 17th. I actually want to use this sticker book. I love using the accessory books in the dashboard layout because I really like this side of the um, book where it has these like long paper pads and the sticky notes. They're super functional. Actually, I should grab the girl with goals sticker book too but yeah i definitely want to incorporate these i've done a spread like this before using these and they're just like i try to keep this pretty functional since this is my social media planner um so yeah if you use your which i feel like this planner is just a functional planner in general so yeah if you use this planner these are great stickers to use especially this theme of sticker book the girl with goals stickers um, they're really good to use for functional planning. This is the other sticker book I wanted to pull, which coordinates with this one. And then I have one of Jessica's from Live Love Posh's sticker book. This one is the Functionally Chic one. And it's got a lot of functional stickers and words and different things like that in here. But it also has these really pretty flowers that I think will be nice to incorporate in this spread. Um, I used these lace ones in another spread recently. Those came out super nice. Um, I think... There's also trackers in here. I think I saw trackers. Other oh, hydrate tracker and vitamins. Okay, so they're already labeled. But I could cut that part off and use them my own way. They're really small, which I like. They don't take up a lot of room. All right, so I can use those too. But yeah, that's the idea for this spread. Okay, so I started pulling some stickers. I have this one which I think I'm gonna put here. I usually don't block off this section because the shading kind of throws me off a little bit. Um, but I think I'm gonna cover that up so that way I won't see as much of the shading like this. Yeah, I like that. Cool. So I'm just gonna do a little white out on some of these things so I don't use any of these like words that they put on here. I don't use the planner that way even in my mini I actually do use like these sections errands and to buy but I still cover them up even in that mini planner all right I kind of wish they just wouldn't put any words to be honest that'd be nice <laughs> okay so I'm gonna layer these two together Maybe a little bit lower so I can see some of the flowers peeking behind there. They're really dark, but I kind of like that, especially for October since it's very like, well, it's Halloween. Well, I know Halloween isn't the whole month, but sometimes, I mean, I decorate for some things for Halloween. And in my planner, I'm decorating my classic planner all Halloween for the whole month. And this is coming from a person who is not into Halloween. Like, in general, like, I don't mind passing out candy, but I never liked dressing up or doing any of that kind of stuff. Oh, no, I ran out. I don't think I have any more. Okay, so I don't have any more tape. I actually need to order more. I don't think I have any more tape. Or I just don't want to go and look for it right now. I, I'm just going to glue this down. I usually don't glue them down, but I like to tape them down. But I think this will be fine for this week to just do it this way. Okay, so this is gonna go here. Oops, a bit higher. Yeah, I usually don't like to glue it because it gets kind of like a little bubbly. Like I can feel some of the glue pieces, but I think it'll. I think it'll go away eventually, hopefully. Okay, I think that works there. I don't know if it looks a little crooked, but it should be fine. Okay, and then I have these. I can grab them. These are actually sticky notes, which are nice. Could put these two here. I'll have to glue these down too because the stickiness on these sticky notes is not the best. 
I could do a little cluster here, flowers. These are all clear stickers, which are really nice. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so I'm gonna take this off and I plan on layering this something like that. Oops. Just put this down first. And that can be layered like so. And then I'll just have to glue these down. I do like to have these sections. I like to have a section for putting down uh, my, um, just things I want to get done for the week when it comes to all the social media things that I do. And then um, I do like to keep track of like some statistics. Oh, I want to do, I forget, a little like habit tracker. Maybe I'll do this tiny one. I'm really bad. Let's see these scissors. I mean, not really, really bad, but I want to make sure I'm I answer like comments. It's just oh my gosh, it takes so much time like on Instagram to do that because I have to type everything with my on my phone. I've tried doing it on my laptop but sometimes after I do so many which is super fast but for whatever reason I don't know if it's just like on my account or whatever but after so many like responses it doesn't let me respond anymore and it's annoying <laughs> so I can only get so much done in like one time when I'm wanted answer comments and respond to comments on Instagram on my laptop and but I have to kind of do most of it on my my phone because for whatever reason on my phone it doesn't do that it doesn't tell me like that it can't post things i don't know it's weird <laughs> i'm gonna do some of these little headers this one says get it done oops right here i like like the dark moody and then with that like pop of purple is really pretty and then I'm probably going to do some, like, um, washi on that side. But for now, I'm going to keep that as it is. I'm going to move on to this. And I'm going to do... I like to put, like, a header over here, so I'm going to do important. I really like the size of these headers because they actually fit within this shaded section. That looks really nice. So I have this. This I usually put my YouTube schedule... Like what videos I want to post over there. Let me go in here. Oh, I have little habit trackers here. But I kind of like that little tiny one. It doesn't take up too much room. Okay, so I have some purple circles that I can use. I'm going to just pull this. We could do a couple. Oh, I like these little quotes. Maybe we can add this. Well, you are doing amazing here to this little cluster. Okay. Oh, I like these two. These little tiny words are nice. I like these two. They say time to. I'm going to add a couple of these just because I've never used them those those pens are cute okay so 
have some boxes. I'm going to put a little layered box there. And I can do another one over here on its own. I wish they had different sizes because I don't like having the same exact size on all of them. Maybe in here they have different sizes. Not quite. Okay, so it's all the same sizes. But I think Jessica's book has some. So I can use those in a bit. I think I want to figure out how I want to add in some more florals. I think I'll do florals here. So I feel like that's a good spot to add them. So I have this corner piece. And I can add here. I'll just cut off the extra pieces. Do you want to put one maybe like here? So I have like a little one or this little. Which I'll have, I want to put like a box. So, you know what? I kind of want to move things around just a little bit if I can. Oh yeah, that comes out super easy. And layer these two together. And this I'll put on this side. So, okay, that works. Okay, I have these time to get these put in here. I'm gonna put the that in there and then this in here. Okay. Oops, All right. I'll look for some more boxes. Oh, if not, I have Jessica's book. I think I mentioned that earlier. Um, to pull from because she's got different sizes in here so I want something okay this is a good size so put this one over here any more purple on the page so have these always like a different kind of purple <laughs> the purples are always like oh well I wish they matched a little bit better but it is what it is yeah that purple this purple is a lot brighter actually let me look in that book because this one tends to have like the same kind of color scheme I oh know these are kind of dark too. Okay, I have this work sticker. Oh, I could do an important. This will help to add some purple. Just don't know if it looks a little bit odd. I'm gonna try it out there and see if. I always move it since it's a sticky note. Maybe that can go there. And this kind of move over here now. I don't 
straighten that. Okay, I'm gonna go with that for now because I don't know what else to do. Okay, I do have some of these like words that I like. So I'm gonna do crushed it. And I'll do best day ever over here because it's Saturday. <laughs> and I really like Saturday, so I feel like that's appropriate for that day. Um maybe I should do another circle sticker. I like using these sticky notes because they're just easy to kind of try out and then see if it works. If not, I could always do something else. I have this purple one. I don't think this is working for me there. So. Okay, I want to find something for here. I have these quotes. I see more purple. mind that one there i just wish the purples matched a little bit better they're kind of all like different shades for whatever reason so that's the only reason why i'm like kind of iffy on them if that works oh i totally ruined this sticker <laughs> let me replace this one i totally ripped it i didn't mean to do that oops some washi which I'm thinking I should have some new washi that I got from the washi tape shop I really like this one it came in like a set but I really like the um polka dots it's really subtle so I'm hoping to be able to see it oh it's so subtle I mean, I like it, but it's just really hard to see the pattern. I'm just gonna put it down. Let's see how it looks. I can always layer another washi on top too. Oh yeah, you can barely see it. I love the dots, but I think they're too light. Especially for like this dark spread. I think I'm just gonna go back to my Old Faithful, <laughs> the grid washi. This one's a darker, has a thicker boulder line. Well, it's not super thick, but it's more noticeable, so that's good. Okay, so I'm just gonna add this washi to a few places around this spread. So I just added some washi in a few places, and I'm going to do um, some of these little bullet points. I'm love love posh. I like these a lot. They're just squares. And they're cute. So I'm going to just add a couple of these. Still, like, not a huge fan of this situation over here. I don't know. Maybe I should switch it. I feel like it's just taking up too much room, to be honest. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to rip this sticker. Okay, I went back to my original idea. I had to glue this down, so I have like a little bit of glue left over on the page, but it'll dry up. Um, yeah, I just wanted something more functional over there that I can write in, because I feel like that's more important in this planner, so 
I think that works. And then I did want to add oops, another um, like little header because I really like the headers in this book. So I can do priorities. I haven't done that word yet. Oh, I was going to put it here, but then I realized there's a header here. Um, never mind. I don't want to put like two headers. No, I already got, and I don't want to put it here because I wanted one over here to balance it, but I guess it's not going to work. So I'm going to put this back in the book. Actually, let me look through this book again. See what else is in here. Oh, these are just words. Okay, maybe I can add a couple of quotes. Oh, wait, this one had really nice quotes in here. These like small ones. Which one did I do? They're doing amazing. This one says, be proud of how far you've come. I like that quote. too much um I like to keep it pretty functional in here even though I do decorate it a bit um but yeah I think this works I really like the color scheme and I like the florals with this um with this spread so yeah I'm gonna put this back in my planner okay so there is my spread love how it turned out um I will make sure to link Jessica's sticker book I'm pretty sure this sticker book is still available and I'm pretty sure these are available too from the Happy Planners website. But yeah, these are the books that I used. I hope you guys all enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of my videos, please hit that subscribe button. And I hope to see you guys all in the next one.